Check out how tired I look. <gasps> wow. This is day 24. Yeah, Wednesday the 24th of June 2020. Had my last shift at a supermarket. Went fairly well. And then it's an absolute desert out there today. It's so hot. It's like 11 o'clock at night now. And it's about... It feels like it's about 25 degrees outside still. Um, we reached like 31 degrees in the afternoon. And it's just so hot. Um, so nothing productive got done today, but I was with my brother, we cracked open a couple of beers, we sat in the garden, in the shade, and generally just had a very kind of slow-paced and pleasant afternoon, so, um, not a lot to report, but it's nice to kind of just celebrate that little chapter of my life, the fact that during lockdown, I joined a supermarket and helped be a key worker during this time, yeah, it didn't feel like I was doing much obviously a lot less than the actual nurses and health workers that are actually on the front line but people need to be fed and there was a recruitment drive and I thought you know what I'm just going to be sitting on my ass at home I could do with the extra money why not I got hired stupidly quickly as well um I applied for the job the Tuesday after Boris Johnson uh enacted the lockdown because it was Monday night when he enacted it I got sending out applications Tuesday I was working, I was working at 6.30am at Tesco's uh, at, on Thursday morning. So less than two days later, I was actually working um, at the store. So it goes to show, you know, if you see an opportunity and you go for it, things might move far, far faster than you're expecting them to. Anyway, um, so what's next for me? Ne it is all about fucking cracking on and um applying the routines that i've come up with as i mentioned there'll be some teething problems between now and next week because july is really where i want to be like i can share some stuff with you i'll be like hey guys this is my routine this is my habits that i want to track these are the habits that i want to track but i also want to they're the bad habits i want to lose here's my fitness routine for the next months i've got a feeling they're going to open gyms um in august because um the they've started easing restrictions they from july the 4th they're opening up gyms hair salons not gyms uh pubs restaurants hair salons but pointedly no gyms which means that they'll probably one of be the last places to reopen and i expect it'll be about three weeks they'll see they'll see if there's been an impact from reopening the pubs They'll monitor that, and then if all goes well, they'll open the gyms, I reckon, about three weeks afterwards. So I think I'm going to be able to go to a gym again in August. That might be optimistic. That might be pure bullshit. I've pulled out my ass, But I think I think gyms will be open in August. So what I'm going to do is I really want to get a, just kind of flexible again. A little bit of cardio, a little bit of ab work, a little bit of like muscle targeting on some of my weaker muscle groups just so I can hit the gym and I don't injure myself. I don't go into the gym and I don't overdo it. I don't feel like, oh my God, I, I'm going back to the gym again. I have to fucking get back into this slowly. I just want to feel like do a month or so of home fitness and then be able to easily translate that into just jumping straight and back into a consistent gym routine. Because I like lifting weights. I'm not, I'm not a massive bodybuilder by any means. But um, it, I have to admit, I do look good when I've got a pump on, so it's enjoyable. You know, I may not take it seriously. Look how tiny my traps are. Look how tiny my shoulders are, you know. But, you know, when you've got a pump on, it's fun. I'm absolutely boiling in this recording studio. I'm absolutely boiling. So, good night, guys. I will look less tired in the next video, I promise. Well, it, it depends if I sleep tonight, considering how hot it is, but yeah. Cheers.